Okay, so the excitement is kicking in right now. We're at Perskill Provincial Park. It's gonna be a whole lot of fun. We're here for a week. So there's a lighthouse down here? That's cool. Maybe this road here, right? Oh, are these buildings you can rent? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Oh, what the heck? Who doesn't clean up after themselves? Man, this is not a pretty sight right now, but uh, in the meantime, we're gonna get set up anyways. So, nobody's calm. I'm just gonna start picking up garbage on my own. for a second that this wasn't gonna cook, but I think we got it. Now I gotta show you what I brought to keep my cameras charged for the week. Hopefully that's gonna be enough. I've got spots where I can plug in my devices or I can simply plug in with the USB. Oh, wasn't so bad. Cheers. Well, it's very hot. Alright, just going for a quick walk to see what we can find along the uh, one of the beaches here. Alright, that was a pretty fun hike along the lake there. One sec. It's a barred owl. decided that my camera bag, my camera, is not leaving my side. I keep seeing so many birds out here. We heard the uh, the barred owl last night. We heard its iconic who cooks for you call. What is that? Curtis. I spilled coffee on myself. I can never wear white. I think it's actually washed off. All right, Sarah made lunch for our hike today to the boardwalk. Well, I fiddled around with the GoPro angles. I'm hoping this is going to work a little better. I really want to get just a backup camera that I can carry around and film all kinds of clips with. For, especially for trips like this, because I want to save my A7 IV, I want to save its battery for wildlife, and I don't want to take the 200 to 600 off of it in case we encounter wildlife. So having a backup camera just so I could record prettier B-roll would be really nice. It's the plan eventually, I keep holding off. Sarah was just pointing at this. We've been seeing a lot of them around the camp. 
We just have to walk along this road for a little bit. We're almost to the uh, boardwalk trail. So they have these walls up to stop the turtles and frogs from crossing the road. So it forces them to use the tunnels underneath. That's pretty cool. Yes. I haven't seen an egret yet this year. That'd be fun. And there's coral cats. Cool. Let's do this. This is going to be fun. Well, there's a lookout right up the middle. That's sick. Yeah, see, within this bay just seems like the best spot. Cool. Look at all that, that is so tall. Okay, so all of these awesome tall plants that we were so excited about turn out to be actually an invader from Europe. Yeah, so like, I mean, not a lot of wildlife, but I'm having a lot of fun recording with an iPhone on a tripod. So there really hasn't been a lot of wildlife out here yet. I don't know if it's time of day, type of weather we've got going on. Maybe we're just being too loud, but it is so beautiful out here. And I've just been having a lot of fun with all like the unique filming. It's over. No wildlife, but it was a fun day. All right. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, that was a big hike. Now I gotta get back up and go grab the camera. So because we plan on having company later this week, we were gonna set up a second tent. Unfortunately, it turns out this one is right full of mold. All right, well, that's probably it for today. It's uh, supposed to rain and off for the rest of the evening. We'll see how badly. I might not get up to anything else. We're just gonna get dinner cooked up here. Can anyone guess what it is? We're doing pasta. Oh, we switched up the chili. We'll see, we'll see. Slight bean chili. White bean chili might be a little bit different. We switched it up. With mild heat. We're here for a whole... It's not scary. Mild heat's not scary. We're here for a whole week. We got lots of meals planned. It's not going to be the same thing. Mostly. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs>
Okay, so I don't know how this is gonna look from the outside, but from the inside, this is gonna look awesome when it's finally dark out. Me helping out the best I can as per usual, Sarah attaching some cute little lights, which will look really nice on the inside. Little solar light there, and they run all through underneath. They follow each pole on the inside. I never recorded it, but the oatmeal this morning tasted like water, like crunchy, chunky water. It was disgusting. For the record, it should have had flavor. There was brown sugar and cinnamon in it. Yeah, it didn't taste like it. It smelled like it, which was odd. It actually smelled good, but there was nothing to it. Mine's in a jar because I wanted some broth. I don't know. I just wanted to bring Sarah along this trail to see all the frogs. And uh, we got majorly sidetracked with what I think are probably just sanderlings. It didn't look like anything else. That's what I was taking photos of in Darlington. So nothing new, but it was kind of fun trying to crawl up to them and get some good shots. We'll see if any of them turned out. I'm not too sure. Pretty new to shoreline, shore, shorebird photos. Owen Point Trail. You've literally just got to walk along, watching the ground. Yes. That was a good spot. I did not spot him. I don't have good eyes. A sand frog. There was a really green one somewhere. I'll have to show you guys the final picture on screen, but yeah, frog. Right down there was super cool. I got a really low angle. Like this. It'll get back to a boil quick. Not a food channel. I did not rinse the rice. You were supposed to rinse the rice? I've never rinsed rice in my life. Yeah, you're supposed to rinse rice. All right, well, we better cut that before we get in trouble. I saw this idea online and I was excited to try it. Simple, just cook up some rice and then grab one of these and add it to the rice. I don't want it to spill everywhere. The scissors. Oh, this is gonna be the best meal we've had all week. It smells good. How much was it? It wasn't too expensive, was it? I have no idea. I didn't pay attention. I was just excited I finally found it. So I have no idea what this costs. Because that was the thing, we're trying to be cost effective on our camping meals. Do you think this is enough sauce? Uh oh. Might not be. If I can't taste the flavor, I'm gonna be very sad. I'm excited for this one because it was my idea. It's underflavored. Two packets is needed, but it doesn't taste bad. 
Exciting. We're heading out of camp to go check out the uh, lighthouse. Sarah's not waiting for me. I really want to get a good shot of this because I was looking online and I didn't really see any crazy photos. So I'm trying to find a good angle on that. You got any idea, Sarah? Okay, I actually just found something else that nobody else seemed to be doing when I looked online. Just a really low angle to include the cobblestone path. Let's go see what the sunset's looking like. One of the big ones just got me. Thank <laughs> you. 